Renfield, this is codependency 101. A narcissist will take full advantage of a codependent's low self-esteem, but you're the one with the real power. And all you gotta do is take it back. How do I do that? Focus on your needs. I mean, I just haven't thought about any of my needs in years. But if you were to stop focusing on his needs, what would happen? If I don't... Yeah, what would what? happen? Stop focusing on his needs, what would happen? He won't grow to full power. Exactly. Right. He won't grow to full power. What? That's so weird. Why would you phrase it like that? But yes, he's right. Sorry to interrupt. Are you okay? I need to get out of a toxic relationship. Why don't you start by telling us what brought you here? My boss, he's different. You can't get him out of your head. No. I need your assistance. I'm coming, Master! Oh, you feel like he could destroy you with the snap of his fingers. Wouldn't even need to snap. Okay. Uh-huh, that sounds familiar. Yeah, what? Renfield. Bring in innocent victims. I want a handful of nuns, a busload of cheerleaders. And I just want a normal life again. But this modern world is a dangerous place. Thank you. You saved my life. Did I watch you cut a guy with a decorative serving platter? It's all in the wrist. Let me explain. My boss gave me this power. In return, I tend to his needs, including care, feeding. You bring in people to eat? You're like the guy that gets the villain's postmates. But if you were to stop focusing on his needs, what would happen? He won't grow to full power. Exactly. Huh. He won't grow to full power. What? That's so weird. Why would you phrase it like that? But yes. Hi, are you here for the meeting? Well, come on. No, oh, no! no! Some call me the Dark One. Others, the Lord of Death. To most, I am the Dracula. Okay, obviously we're dealing with a little bit more than just narcissism here. Now, let's eat. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>